Kyle's going to let us know what we need to know today. What do we need to know today? To get out? A man in Maryland was arrested for attempting to support ISIS. The 30-year-old man actually pledged his allegiance to ISIS back in February. Later told his brother he wanted to die as a martyr, then received nearly $9,000 in payments from people um, that were associated with ISIS. Now, he told authorities that he was just trying to con them out of money. Of course, he's been arrested and faces several, several charges. Now, hundreds of women are actually claiming that a very popular celebrity-endorsed hair product, WEN, is causing their hair to fall out in clumps. More than 200 people in 40 states have filed a class action lawsuit against this company. It was developed by celebrity hairstylist Chaz Dean, and you may have seen Brooke Shields and Alyssa Milano in the infomercials. But many women not only report that their hair is falling out, but say that um, it's caused them to be depressed and not want to go out in public. WEN had an extremely successful launch, breaking in $100 million in its second year. Mm. When? When, like W H E N? W E N. It's like a shampoo, conditioner, and cleanser all in one. And apparently, it's causing all kinds of problems, despite the fact that if you look at it on Amazon, it gets all kinds of positive reviews. So, mm. something to keep in mind when you're out shopping for hair care products. Cyber Monday orders took longer to arrive to their destination this year. The slowdown's likely due to the fact that more Americans are now shopping online for the holidays, and shippers like UPS and FedEx are having a little trouble keeping up. Keep in mind that if you are trying to send out packages for the holidays, USPS has today's date. This is today. Oh, really? The actual like cutoff date for ground services um, to get to your your people. So by unless Christmas. you want to use like uh, you know like FedEx or UPS or something and pay extra. Well, you're going to pay extra no matter what if you wait. December 19th you, is the is the cutoff for first class mail. December 21st is the cutoff for priority mail. And if you are a real procrastinator, December 23rd is the cutoff for priority mail. But you definitely pay for it. Well, then I'd like to tell all my nieces and nephews you'll be getting some New Year's presents. <laughs> there you go. Uh, this is it's it, this could be the greatest invention of all time. A chemist actually developed a coffee that provides the same benefits to the heart as red wine. They infused coffee beans with Reservatrol, which is the natural antioxidant found in the skins of the grapes used to make the red wine. He calls the new product Cough V and says each cup provides the same amount of antioxidants as a glass of red wine. This on the heels of studies that are showing a glass of red wine may have the same effect on a body as an hour of workout. Like I said, could be the Dang. best, greatest invention of all I went to that phase where they said wine is good for you, one glass of wine. So uh -huh. The red wine. I would drink it once a night and I would slam it like a shot Yeah, because I think wine <laughs> so is so gross. disgusting. I know. And it, and then finally, it was like, I go, there's got to be another way. And someone was like, well, just take Reservatol. So I started taking Reservatol pills, yeah, which well, is much better than drinking that, wine. <laughs> could be. Well, with this new coffee, you get the red wine benefits, the coffee benefits, and apparently you're working out as well. You so know, I've I never had a cup of coffee in my entire <laughs> life, ever in my entire life, really? ever. I think it's, I think it smells so disgusting. Oh, I oh love really? The smell of it. I, I, I like love the smell of coffee. Yeah. I just don't like the way it tastes. Uh, now, if they it. could do the wine and maybe put some pot in there too, I think they'd have a home <laughs> oh, run. Oh wow, wow! Yeah, put it that's, all in there. That's their next mission, and that's what you need to know.